Hello everyone, it's me, Warmester. Welcome back to another episode of European War 7 Medieval. So this is a beta testing release from EasyTech. Uh, it's just for iOS only, for iPhones and iPad, and for Android, I don't think it's having right now. Uh, I think that uh, this uh, beta testing is available only for a few regions such as Korea, Vietnam, Thailand, uh, Russia, Canada, Germany, and many other more. Yeah, Canada, Thailand, Korea, Italy, Russia, Poland, Vietnam, and France can search and download European War 7 on App Store. Uh, I think this beta testing for this because uh, the reason for that because EasyTech promises that the game would be out uh, at the end of 2021, but for now, there's still some bug that we need to uh, check on. The bug is this one here. Uh, the uh, I'm not I'm not looking for tutorial right now. Can just skip. Okay. So this is the bug here. Uh, I'm right now. I'm using a Vietnamese Apple ID, and uh, this is Dong Dong Dong, and this is Yen. So this is a Chinese, no, a Japanese. Uh, currency, so it's still in beta, meaning it's still not yet. And you can see there's a character, the King of the Huns, Father of Europe, Burning Lion Hearts, Eternal Kings, Arabian Knights, and Valkyries. This count you have free packs, okay? Free, okay, I'll take that. Uh, Royal Treasury, Soldier Replenishments, Soldier Upgrades, Hero Upgrade, Lucky Cards, Medals. You got uh, different ones, shops, you got coin, Gold, Wardrum, Scarecrow, Quantain, Quintain or Quintain? Quintain, Target, uh, Heraldry, Seal, and... Oh, this is the, the, the stone. Mithril, they call it the Mithril. Okay. So, have a look at this. This is the options. So, the option is actually cool. You got a game speed, which I've seen already. Also, the color. If you change it, you can see the, the, the colors change. From saturations, from zero into maximum. So, you can change the color of the game as well. And you can also see the effect, the effect right here. It's either performance or power. So you can choose whatever you want. I want performance, meaning the game will be less lag. You can see the animation is flowing and it's actually good. But if you click into power, animations getting stutter a little bit, right? You can see right there, okay? You can see the animation difference and performance is really flow. And power, I don't know. Uh, what's different between that? Maybe there's some changes in that, but we'll see. Confirm. Uh, this is the login reward for first day, second day, third, fourth, and the fifth, the sixth, the seventh. And you will get Ivar. Ivar is a... Uh, who is the hell is that? A Viking leader. He was son of Ragnar, Ragnar Lobrook and his wife, Ursula. He was the Hafton Ragnarsson brother. Okay. Very nice. Uh, okay, what's next? Uh, generals, you got King of the Huns. What are you drop? Yeah, yeah. So this specialty about that, you can get a privilege, uh, initials, battle resource, double in conquest mode, half price for recruiting generals, privilege for father of Europe is initial numbers of general available plus one, privilege for Lionheart is 50 medals per day, for lock-in, for eternal kings you got 7,500 uh, goals, and for Arabian knights you got uh, one general as well, and for Valkyrie you will get 7,500 goals, the same as uh, eternal kings, okay. Okay, very nice. Conquest is still, but you need to finish the first chapter to get the conquest. This is for the campaign. I haven't yet signed in. Also, this is the customer service, the notice, the questionnaires. Okay, you can call them, contact them, whatever you want. This is version 1.1.5. Okay. Uh, game Center, not yet signed in. I don't know why. It's asked me to sign in, but I didn't do it. <laughs> Anyways, okay, let's let's go to... Oh, we got a Triumphs. Okay, you got ads, you got Bonds, you got Honor. Bond, the love of the world, Byzantine war god, you got Justin Steen the first, you got Theodora, you got Belarus, you got Nase, you got Arthur, Jovina, Geneve, Lancelot, uh, Ivar, Haftan Ragnarsson, Sunat, I thought it was a cunt, <laughs> Zengi, Noadin, Saladin, Genghis Khan, Batu Khan, Jebe, you got Richard the first, Philip the second, Frederick the first, you got Edward the first, Edward the third, Edward the Black Prince is white. It's not black. Oh, by the way, I love this. The the detail on this one is actually good. Okay, very nice. Uh, you got the last Romans, you got Rise of Byzantine, Establishment of the Kingdom, Border Crisis, Viking Invasion, Macedonian Dynasty, Pharaoh Treasure, House of Normandy, uh, Komenos Dynasty, Burning Crusades, you got Angevin Dynasty, Reconstruction of the Byzantines, Ottoman Invasion. Oh, yeah! 
You finally got the Ottomans. Hundred Years War. A War of the Roses. Nice, nice, nice. Jonovac. General. You got Zaladin, Jamala, Attila, Richard the First, Arthur, Olga, Belarus, Frederick. Who's next? Alfred the Great. Edward the Black Prince, Genghis Khan. Edward the First, Robert the Proust, Noradin, El Shit, Jean of Arc. You got William Wallace, Otto the First, and Shinets. And this one is Constantine, Naze, Roland, Lancelot, Khalid, Ghostcard, Helacris, Harold Halalda. What's next? Uh, William the Conqueror, Balvin. Oh, I love this. I, I love the math. King of Jerusalem. I love the math. Philip the Second, Henry, Second King of England, Justin, uh, the guy who made July and August, Empress Matilda, Nick Forrest, Selman of Bulgaria, Alexios the first, Basil the first, Caesar still here. Okay, I thought he was dead. Robin Hood and Beowulf. You got Ofman, Alaric, Ale, Valens, Igeleres, Sigel Gartaya, Al Aslan, Atheist, Athens, Charles Martel, William the first of Sicily, Harold, Raph, Neville, Matilda of Boulogne, Eleanor of Provence. I think this one is Italy. Philip the Good. Where's Philip the Bad? Eleanor the Aquatine, Isabella, Malik Shah, Sabutai, Timor, Lady Margaret, Elizabeth Woodville, Constantine the Eleven, Samuel of Bulgaria, Alfred the First, Haftan Ragnarsson, Edward the Third, Richard of York, Iwar, Baibar, Bessas, you got uh, Vitiges, Batukan, Jebe, Godfrey, uh, Godfrey, Pepin the Short, Jemain, Sarus, Zenki, I think that's all. And now there's one. Also, oh, there's bronze, silver, gold, and super gold. Fausta, Tidoric, Gondric, Aldi, Solcho, Zibia. Okay. Another Muslim one. It looks actually good. You got Toxic, Leopold I, Geitha, Jean Shadows, Kavala, Sunikas, Guy, Guy of Luzin, Luzinian, Luz, Luzignan, Antoine, Tidora, Robert Corhos, Suleiman, Baltuklu, Hermeric, Zubaya. Sitas, Tritius, Leo the Third, uh, Andronikos, Edmund, Tolita, Alfred, William Iron Arm, Balawin the Third, Roger, Emma, Edward of Norwich, uh, Watergen, Watimore, Cardigan, Ath, Athelfrid. Oh, what a name! John the Armenian, John the Armenian, not bad. Commander of the Byzantine Empire. Okay, Andronikos the Third, Exak the Third. Gaston the fourth, Leo the sixth, the wise, Juraville, Aikham, Lupinicus, Gelima, and Kadafel. Okay, that's also add so honor. This is for rewards. Oh, I, I love the stamp, the design. Unlock all advanced level for 329, 3020. Wait, this is long. Uh, 30,020. Wait. 9,000, 20, 300,000, 29,000, 329,000 dong. How much is that? Let me, let me convert that. I think dong is really cheap. That's why the currency is blowing up. Uh, we and dong to USD. 329. That would be $15, I guess. Yeah, $15. It's quite cheap, by the way. Headquarters. Oh, you can get your general. You got Zaladin. I love, I love the, the, the detail. Oh my god, that's so cool. Anyway, let's play our first mission. Why not? The last Roman. Invasion of the multiple enemy has weakened the Roman Empire even further. A constant change to the throne in the past two decades have exacerbated the turmoil even further. Roman Empire would appear to be the last on its legs. Okay. Oh, I love the detail, the big maps. In 376 AD, the Viscot sword refuge from the Roman Empire against the invading Huns. However, after crossing the Danube, many conflicts broke out with the Romans. Finally, the two side battled in Marcionopolis. Okay, let's play. Okay. It's a bit laggy. I change it to performance. You can see the smoothness. Oh my god! Yeah! This is actually cool. The, the movement right here. And if you look into the power, Ah, the laggy. But I will see how the effects work. Let's, let's go to performance first. Performance. Oh, yeah, that's dope. That's dope. 
let's see the laggy. Uh, let's see the laggy. Let's see the, the the power. Let's see the power. Yeah, it's the same. I would go with performance. It's better. It's less laggy. And it's actually better. Wait, you can do that multiple times. That's nice. Oh yeah, boy. That's actually good. Cities, you got fortification, house, workshops, recruits, you got swordsmen, infantry guards, counter infantry, you got spear militia, spearmen, melee cavalry, you got cell cavalry, charging cavalry, you got lance cavalry, range infantry, you got javelinier, range cavalry, you got javelinier, riders, all have in animations. This game is gonna drain your batteries, boy. Trust me. You got a war drum, you got a war gear. That's for besieging a cities. I will try to understand this more and uh, you will be able to move within points as well. This is actually good. Skill sets. Oh, 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 okay, okay. So we got Spear Militia, Javanir and Javaniers. It's actually good. So let's just end the turns. Oh my God, it's actually good. But it's also giving me headaches, I don't know why. <laughs> Defeats all the enemies, player force defeat, okay. So you got recruits, I will get range, okay. Follow the Romans. I will move it here, have some, sp ah, no, 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 no. Oh, that's dope, that's dope. And it's, it's less OP than before. And now you got the flag, you can see here, it represents the flag. I liked it. I like it. It represents the flag. Because back in the days, the, we don't have flags. You only have the options to put your emblems on your uh, health points. And now you got the flags. And turns. Oh, wait, wait. Should I? Wardrum. Item for rec uh, recovering small amount of troops in battles. Okay, okay. Never mind. Also, this is the option to tell you that you still have troops to use. Oh, that's, that's actually good. Uh, well thought about it. Easy tech, smart. Meaning that your troops still have movement points. My troops are under attack. I know. Because I'm doing it. Meaning how many turns you still have left. Wait, you know you're unstoppable, huh? Okay, you can see here, still one left. Okay, let me recruit infantry guards, uh, javelineers, and turns. Okay, so now this is option to tell you you still have troop to use. Uh, well thought. So that's actually good. A new improvement. Oh my god, that's OP. OP. 65. Still one more. Which one? This one. And it's it's actually HD. You can see here the movement, the 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 details. Man. Respect to Easy Tech for doing that, man. Like it's really details. Oh, I cannot break the cities. Bruh, you're dead, bro. You're dead. The enemies are no match for me and the situation is under control. Very nice. There's also a movement point. Okay, I like this one. Uh, it's, it's actually similar to Total Wars because uh, during Total War games, there's a movement point Movement point will tell you uh, how your troops work and uh, how long will it stay, how long will it last, will it be able to attack, will it be able to withdraw or withstand against the enemies. I like that one. This is a good improvement from Easy Tech. How do I break? Oh, I need a battering ram in order to break the city. I cannot just use my troops no, now, for now. Uh, 
recruits, let's say counter melee infantry, war gears, battering rams, my nice. Infantry guards, war gear. Okay, I can't do that anymore. And turn. Okay, I, I can't do it with my troops again. My apologies. I thought it was gonna be undone. But uh, with, with, with troops, with uh, equipment, battering rams, you can uh, do it faster and break the cities. Okay. Which is way better than 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 uh, bear bear troops, if I'm saying that right. Okay, let's break it. Twenty-seven, fifty-three. I like the animation. Not bad. Okay, the city's falling, bro. Nice. Tap anywhere to quit. Can I just switch off? <laughs> Lupinus and you got a victory. Tap anywhere to quit between all animations. Okay, very nice. Okay, so you got the Battle of Marciano, Battle of Antropo, Battle of Polentia, First Habsburg War, Wireless War, Battle of the Novosa Mountain, Battle of Carthage, Battle of Chazon, Second Habsburg Wireless War. Okay, I will do that later. This is just a quick review, a quick look, by the way. It's not that bad. For the first beta testing, I don't know uh, how long will it start, but uh, we'll see about that. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.